Hey everyone, today we're going to do a floral eye design. This is inspired by an image I saw from Breerly Thorpe, I believe is how you pronounce her name. We're going to start with a tag pearl color, very small amount of water on that sponge. You don't want to drown anybody's eye in water or paint, so make sure to have that sponge almost dry when you're working around the eye. I'm going to dab a little splash of yellow-orange color just for fun. Add iridescent cosmetic grade glitter you can find at sillyfarm.com. Now we're going to start loading our three-quarter angle brush with a standard rose cake. Here's a quick tip. If you take a sponge, dampen it, and rub that top layer of the arty cake, you'll be able to start with a brand new a clean cake under that. So here we go, we're reloading. And we're gonna form some petal shapes here. Remember in nature there are all sorts of different petal shapes. Don't be afraid to get creative here. We're going to reload and fill in this space we have here. I'm going to use my hand, and it's a trick I use at festivals as well. Just place my hand there in front of their nose and go ahead and blow uh, on the painting to dry it. And that's just so I don't shock them when I'm <laughs> blowing on the face paint. So now that we've filled that space, I'm going to go ahead and add a second petal layer. And I know that I want this petal layer to be shorter than the original base. So I'm going to make sure that I make these petals shorter than the original base we have here. Model's a little tired. So here we go, and there you have it. So that's the second petal layer. Always remember to forgive yourself um, remember that nature is all full of different shapes, colors, so be sure to experiment. Here we're going to be using Diamond Effects Metallic Green. It's a darker green and still got that shimmer, a little bit of shimmer in it. So I like using it for very thin vines and swirls and teardrops. Here we are just getting creative and leading those out. Make sure you pay attention to the contours of the face, like the, the shape of the face you're working with. Here, of course, we're going around the eye, so we're going to form that sort of elongated C shape. That's where I'm leading my design to go. Here, we're going to go ahead and place some very tiny dots uh, on the base of those, or what would be... The, the ends of those flowers there. I'm sorry, the base of the flower. Now I'm going to take some Fab White. Um, you can use any brand of white paint you prefer. And I'm going to focus more on the edge of the petals here. I want it to stand out a little more. So... I'm going to just very, with a wispy motion, kind of outline this a little bit sporadically just because I want those edges of the petals to pop a little bit. Now 
Now I'm gonna add groups of dots where I wanna draw people's eye. So I see this as more of like a focal point type and I wanna draw their, draw their eye around uh, this particular design. So I'm gonna place them where I think uh, or, or feel that it would be most useful here. And it looks so pretty. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it.